Switching gears to a reunion against all odds, a woman driving to Florida to see friends ends up losing her dog along the way. But then a Pinellas County couple happened to find that dog in another state. ABC Action News reporter Julie Salamon shows us how that dog found her way back home. Share this video as much as you can because we found this dog. We're in Georgia right now of 75. Miles McKinney and his fiance Rachel Newman posted a video to social media hoping someone knew the dog's owner. They rescued a dog they saw wandering around a Georgia gas station. The couple from Pinellas County spent a week traveling visiting South Carolina to see family before stopping at that Georgia gas station on the way home. I felt bad taking the dog but then I was like <laughs> it's either like we're taking the dog or like you're not going to find her someone's going to take her and not care or she's going to get like ran over some because the highway was right there. The dog's owner, Terry Wells, says she was driving from Minnesota where she lives to central Florida. She says her dog, Honey, somehow slipped out of the car when she stopped at that Georgia gas station. When she returned to the gas station, the dog was long gone. Got there, no dog. Somebody from Florida took her. I'm like, great, they got a pet for grandma. <laughs> I never thought I'd see her again just because of that. She's so sweet. <laughs> Honey did not have a microchip or a name or a number on her collar. McKinney and his fiance gave the dog to Suncoast Animal League, an animal shelter in Pinellas County. The rescue searched for days for the dog's owner and finally saw a post about Honey on a Facebook page for lost pets in Georgia. The animal shelter connected the dots. I'm just, I'm floored. I'm blown away every time I think about it. It's a miracle, you know? I started to lose hope. Nearly a week later, Wells and her dog were reunited on Thursday. Wells says she knows she made some mistakes. Her dog is now microchipped. It's just so rewarding knowing that she's home. Two strangers who did a good deed allowed Honey to find her way back home. In Pinellas County, Julie Salmon, ABC Action News. And the Suncoast Animal League microchipped Honey. And on December 4th, the league will hold a microchip clinic where they will microchip chip 100 dogs or cats for free. If a dog or cat is lost, a shelter or a vet may scan the dog for a microchip, and that chip contains the owner's contact information to get the pet safely back home. We'll share more info about that event right now on abcactionnews.com.